Hey, we reached your Acevedo a day before the actual fight on a Friday, not a Saturday, so the fans gotta remember that. Cinco, cuatro de mayo, not cinco de mayo. Um, you just got your meal in, man. Yeah, what, man. What, what I'm did that consist up. of? What did, what did oh, yeah, I, I ate some uh, chicken penne, uh, chilies, some pasta, yeah. and then a steak with some mashed potatoes. Yeah. It was delicious. How, how does that feel, bro? Like, you're making the weight when you're hungry, like, for the fans. We can't, we can't really relate. We can only say, oh, he's struggling with weight. He didn't make weight. But how does it feel when you make weight in them? Oh, it's, it's, a, it's a proud moment because yeah. all that discipline and all that hard work, you know, it pays off. You know, it, I would I would hate to see myself like be overweight. You know, like and, and you having, work so having hard. This, yeah, and yeah. you work so hard, and you still have to freaking lose, shred some some weight. You know, is is that the hardest part for you? Yeah, that's not, not for you, but like in general, every, every fighter that's has the hardest the battle, man. Yeah, yeah. once you beat that, it's, it's on. You think that um, us as the fans and the media, we kind of take that for granted? How every time you guys make weight. We're like, you make weight, but the one time that you don't, we're gonna point it out like, he yeah. make weight. But it's like the hardest part for a fighter. Nah, right? yeah, man. Well, a lot of people don't know what a fighter has to go through, you know, like leading up to the fight behind doors, you know, like it's tough. Yeah. It's tough. This sport's not for everybody. What's, what's the one thing that um, mellows you out, just like gets you in that groove where nothing bothers you and you're just concentrated, focused, you're calm, you know? What's that one thing for you? Is it a. Is it like, um, how, how do you call it, like um, a superstition, a tradition, something that you do before, before like the rain or something? Or? I think about my family, you know, my family, my mom, my, my dad, my daughter. It's, you know, that's, that's what I think about, that's what focuses me. And, you know, because at the end of the day, that's who I'm doing it for. Yeah. That's what I'm fighting for. Yeah. How, um, how is, how is it to be away from them? Because you're away from them, right? You're yeah. Here, you're in camp. How, how's that? Like, it's hard, it... you know? It's, it's hard, but it's, at the same time, I take it as motivation, you know? Like my pops always said, you know, always try to look at the, the positive things in life. You know, I always try to look the positive way. Yeah. So I try to keep myself positive, just it's all on mental, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all on the mindset. So what do you do now, man, after the weigh-in and everything? All right, right now, uh, coach is going to take me to go go to the store get some snacks yeah. and then so I could just chill in my room watch a movie relax is there a movie you saw you, you watch in particular or just anything no nah, just anything I, I want to watch that uh, Avengers no nah, I want to <laughs> watch that that new 50 movie the 50 cent one which was that uh, oh um the, the one where they robbed the bank yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. I was starting to watch it the other day ball. It's yeah. good. It's that Dan of Thieves? Yeah, yeah, Dan of Thieves. There you go. I was That's starting to watch it, but I want to finish it, so yeah, I'm yeah, probably going to watch that upstairs. All right, tell the fans who to follow you. Yeah, uh, follow me on all social media, Kansas Kid 620.